In recent years, Ethiopian Airlines has become one of the key players of African commercial aviation. It operates a diverse fleet comprising both wide-body and narrow-body designs, as well as regional aircraft. It may be set to further diversify the former of these categories as it weighs up its options for another potential twin aisle order. Addis Ababa based Star Alliance member Ethiopian Airlines has confirmed that it is in the final stages of its decision making process regarding its next wide body order. Speaking to Aviation Week, the carrier CEO Tewolde Gebre Mariam confirmed at the start of October that one of the designs that he's considering is the stretched fuselage Airbus A350-1000. The Dash 1000 variant of Airbus's next-generation wide-body family clocks in at 73.79 meters long. This gives it an added 7 meters of length over the 66.8 meter long A350-900 variant, which typically translates to around 55 extra seats. However, the extra capacity isn't the only selling point for Ethiopian Airlines. Indeed, Gebre Mariam told Aviation Week, it looks like the A350-1000 is good for the high altitude of 2200 meters or 7200 feet above sea level at our hub at Addis Ababa Bole International Airport, so we're okay with the aircraft performance. While Gebre Mariam considers the A350-1000 to be an attractive proportion for his airline, it's not the only wide-body design that the Ethiopian Group CEO is considering. Indeed, he's also weighing up the possibility of bringing the Boeing 777X series to Addis Ababa. Regarding Boeing's next-generation wide-body, Gebra Mariam told Aviation Week, As you know, the 777X is delayed. However, we are talking with Boeing as well. Before the end of the year, we plan to have made a decision. This means that we should see Ethiopian add to its order book in the next few months. Regardless of which design the airline goes for, Gebra Mariam plans to order at least 10 wide bodies to accompany his carrier's existing twin aisle fleet. In terms of its existing fleet, Ethiopian Airlines presently has 66 wide bodies. Of these, the majority are Boeing jets, with the only Airbus representation coming from 16 A350 900s. However, the carrier does also have a further eight of these twin jets on order. In terms of Boeing aircraft, Ethiopian's most common type is the 7878, of which it operates 19. There are also eight 7879s in the airline's fleet, alongside four 767-300ERs. Ethiopian's remaining wide bodies come from the 777 family. The airline has six 777-200LRs, nine 777-200Fs and four 777-300ERs. With Ethiopian already having a diverse fleet of aircraft and wide bodies from both Airbus and Boeing, it doesn't look like commonality with existing jets will be much of an issue. Ultimately, as with any aircraft order, pricing, delivery times and performance will all need to be carefully considered. What do you make of Ethiopian Airlines' potential wide body order? Which twin aisle design would you most like to see the carrier take on? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. If you want to hear more about Ethiopian Airlines, we'll be speaking to the airline CEO and other industry leaders in early November at Simple Flying's online Future Flying Forum event. Keep watching to find out what it's all about. The future of aviation shines bright. Take your seat, fasten your seatbelt, and join us on a flight like no other. Meet and greet aviation's movers and shakers. Hear from leading airline CEOs. Discover new products and technologies. Join the debate. Network. Connect. Win. Get your free boarding pass today at futureflyingforum.com. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles and a podcast every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe before you go.